Hey everyone, I'm John. This is 16 Paces, the story of my garden. One of my goals is to do things that will enhance environmental sustainability. Let me share a few of the things that I'm doing to accomplish that goal. The soil is where I'm making the most positive improvement. You see, last year when I decided to start a front yard garden, it was too late in the season to really start. Uh, but I started making some compost. Now, I had this creative idea. I knew I'd need a lot of compost, and I didn't want to pay for it all. So I went to the grocery store and I asked the manager if I could have uh, all the organic waste that they were just going to throw away. And he said yes. So I started composting banana peels and pineapple slices and everything that the grocery store was just throwing away. Now before I show you my compost bin, I want to explain that I built the entire thing out of scrap material. And the way I see it, I recycled that wood and I gave it a new purpose in life. Here's the abomination. Just a bunch of scrap wood that I screwed together. But you know what? I'm accomplishing two of my goals. One, I'm being more uh, cost effective because, hey, this was really cheap. And two, I'm being more environmentally sustainable. Now there are some truly remarkable advances in restorative and renewable technologies happening right now. But until these truly sustainable developments occur, we will need to embrace solutions outside of technology to help us meet our sustainability goals. Now, I used to be a garbage man, and I know firsthand uh, from seeing core samples at the landfill that once organic material is hermetically sealed inside the landfill, it takes a long time before it breaks down. And when it finally does break down, it actually turns into methane instead of CO2. And as it turns out, methane is several times more potent of a greenhouse gas than CO2. Now in my city, almost half of our carbon footprint comes from the landfill. So one of the biggest behavioral changes that we can embrace right now is to start composting household organics. All right, so call me crazy for taking composting to such an extreme, but you know what? I'm proud that I diverted all of that organic waste from the landfill. One final thought. Imagine all the topsoil in North America. Now imagine that every year at harvest season, uh, a percentage of that gets turned into food and then shipped to market, ultimately ending up in either landfills or in the sewers. Uh, every year, we deplete more and more of our soil and, uh, and lock it up for thousands of years by mixing it with all the toxic chemicals that we throw away with it. Uh, so keep that in mind. The next time you throw away carrot tops and orange peels and, and eggshells, uh, along with the rest of your household garbage, the plastic and all that stuff. Uh, it's going to be locked up in the landfill for a very long time, and those nutrients aren't going to be cycled back into the soil. So thank you everybody for watching. Uh, I look forward to hearing your feedback. And once again, I'm grateful for all the likes and the shares and the comments that I've been getting on social media. Cheers!